I'm Russell Kennedy. I'm the Business Systems Manager at the Department of Economic Development, Tourism and the Arts. I guess that's probably one of the drivers here. We've got this great sort of new set of buildings down there, which is um, really great. So obviously it's nice to have a system behind that that supports management of the members in a really efficient and, and sort of modern way, I guess. I guess probably the, the biggest thing is it's not a system in the IT sense, but it's a system in terms of it's a collection of spreadsheets, some paper-based documents, some old databases, so there's no central source, so really um, you're trying to manage a whole range of sources, there's duplication of data, that sort of thing, so uh -huh. it's not an easy job for the people down there. Yeah, I think so, as the memberships increased and also as... Um, people leave because some of the information is actually in, in people's heads. It's not necessarily within uh, formatted systems. So yeah, it's. Um, I guess an ideal replacement would be something that's modern. So it's using, I guess, modern features that we might experience with other systems contemporarily out in the marketplace. So websites, etc. It'll allow users to interact themselves, so to go in, check your information, update your information, um, do things like that. It will also enable staff to be able to manage, report upon what's happening in the system, um, you know, collate information, give us targeted marketing at people who have interests in particular aspects of the museum. We can then send them flyers and whatnot if we have special needs. I think it will. I mean, obviously, TMAG's been redeveloped, so there's some great new displays to see, and really they're the custodian of you know, thousands of artefacts of our cultural heritage. So I think it will help them by being able to um, efficiently manage those people, to um, advertise that there's benefits for joining up, so you can you know, contribute, you can you know, um, become active and involved in parts of the museum, you can volunteer your time. So yeah, I think being able to manage it efficiently enables you to increase the, um, the base of people helping out.